Skyblock Thunder on Prime MC. Now, uh, well, before I start off the episode, I was going to sell some stuff from my IG and my ZP grinder. And, well, I noticed that some of you guys have left me a bunch more stuff. So, uh, this is all I've gotten so far. I don't know if there's anything new in there, but. So, one of you left me 160k. That's from Camaro Brine. And I also right here enjoy the 160k. And, yo, I mean, that's actually pretty sick. That he used a rename tag just to rename an emerald to that. I mean, rename tags, I un unless, unless I changed, like, the rarity on them, I'm, I think they're pretty rare. So that is actually pretty sick that we got a renamed emerald. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure that rename tags are uh, still fairly rare items. But also, we got two iron golem spawners and this donation book. So I don't know, I don't really know where the iron golem spawners came from, maybe in here. Hey dude, I watched your vids and wanted to make a donation to the island. I have left a few IGs, okay, so I guess this was him, uh, in the chest to help your way, to, to help you on your way. I play on Thunder quite a lot and hope to see you around. P.S. If you could look at my island, maybe the island today, that would be amazing. Keep the great work and have a nice day. So, I know I kind of read that fast, but I kind of want to get on with the episode, but yo, two Iron Golem spawners. Thank you so much, Toast of London. So, I will add these to my Iron Golem grinder in just a second. Also, 30k from Uncle's Eye Fan, which is pretty sick. I mean, we do need money right now, and anything helps, so shout out to you, dude. We also got 630k from, I think I'm saying this right now, Rich Smith. Apparently, that's like Dutch or something, so I said it wrong. Um, more, a uh, book that says more free stuff on it. Potion of Swiftness and 34 vote key. Actually, did, I, I don't know if the Potion of Swiftness was from him. I just found that in there, but... Uh, I, I guess, I guess I'll keep that, I mean, I, I, th I think I have a lot of those, but, you know, I guess I'll keep it anyways, but, I mean, 34 vote keys and 630k, let me quickly read this book also, hey, got you, an got another gift for you, 28 vote keys, at 28, so we're the four, so we're the other four from someone else, or the other six, I mean, okay, I don't know, but I hope you will continue your series, and I did, and it didn't expect you to be able to s spell my name correctly, that's because I'm Dutch, but if, okay, so yeah, right there, if would have been American, you could say my name means Rich Smith, okay, so, uh, there's his name right there, but okay, so thank you so much, Rich Smith, now that I can finally say that correctly, but that is actually pretty sick, so I'm gonna go ahead, apply at least to my balance, and look at that, we just went, we just got to two mil just off of that, we almost, I think we almost got a million from that, we got like 850k, so, that was pretty sick, and these 34 vote keys, I guess these books, I'll just throw into my PV for now, and uh, along with this and the Potion of Swiftness, but you guys tell me what you want to do with these vote keys. I'm gonna open, let's say, I'll, I guess I'll open 5 right now, tell me what to do with the other 29, uh, I don't know, maybe I could do an episode where in the beginning of it I open like a bunch of keys, or something like that, like, I, I don't know what, should I, like, maybe just save these for other episodes, but let's go with our first voting crate key, and if I could get another spawner, I mean, I have the money right now to change, uh, quite a few spawners, I mean, I think if I wanted to change them to Iron Golem or Zombie Pigmen, I'd be able to change, like, I think 2.2 mil would let me change, oh, and uh, another 50k right there, um, so 2.2 mil, I think would let me change, uh, Wait, that's like 11 of them, I, I I think. I mean, if they're 200k each, then yeah. If math is right, then that, that that should be it. But okay, so let's just get on with our second vote key. If we can, can, can we get that spawner? If we can get that, then I'll definitely, I didn't actually know. Should I add it to my ZP grinder or should I add it to my IG? I, I, because, I mean, honestly, okay, well, 32 gold, whatever. But as I was saying, honestly, my uh, zombie pigment grinder honestly needs a little bit more attention because uh, it doesn't really have that many spawners in it at the moment. Only like six. And I mean, my Iron Golem one has like 12 in it. So I don't think, and, well, 14 because of these two. But okay, 25k. I was hoping it would land on the spawner. But you know, I will go ahead and take that. That actually brings me to 2.3 mil, which is pretty sick. But let's go with our fourth voting crakey. And okay, we've gotten the spawners in uh, three of these so far. But we haven't actually gotten one out of it. I mean, well, what I, what, what I mean by that is we've seen spawners in three of these, but we haven't actually gotten one out of it. So if we could get one in this one, 
I'm just saying, Labby pretty good, and seriously, 16 iron. I mean, I'll, 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 I guess I'll sell that. That only gets me like 128k, or not 120, not even that. I mean, I meant to say 128. So let's just go on with our last voting crate key then. Please be something good, okay? This one, this one doesn't even have anything that great in it, so I'm just gonna close it out. And uh, uh, well, okay, I guess we got the diamonds. I'll go ahead and um sell those. And uh, eight diamonds got us more than 16 iron did. I mean, I guess 5k is a decent amount just for getting eight diamonds. But okay, I guess I'll slash block these. That'll be enough for three blocks. And I know that isn't really that much, but I'm gonna go ahead. Add these up here, add my uh, Iron Golem spawners to the Iron Golem grinder, and then let's go on with the build this episode. And actually, before we do that, I almost always forget this last episode, but I, I remember, like, last minute before I actually start building, Island of the Day is slash IS Warp BB Bear, BBB Bear, I don't know how you want me to say, oh, blocked, uh, oh, okay, Len. Okay, so I guess Island of the Day will have to be this guy that actually gave us the two Iron Golem spawners. You know, I guess I'll, I, I guess I'll go ahead and review his island for those two IGs. And, uh, oh, okay, so what's this? Um, looks like he has, okay, parachute storage empty. Wait, why, why, why parachute storage? Is there, is there anything out here? Uh, oh, wait, oh, this is a plane. Oh, that's actually so cool. I love all this looks. Okay, that's why that said parachute storage. Okay, I was I was a little confused there, to be completely honest. And I was like, wait, parachutes? Why? But, okay, that actually looks so cool. And, uh, oh, he actually has a, a pretty huge island down there. Um, Actually, how how far away is this from the ground? Let me see. I mean, it's kind of hard to tell from all the way up here. Let me kind of check. Uh Oh, oh, whoa. Oh, gosh. Okay, that's way farther than I thought it was. Oh, and he has a bunch of slime blocks down here. Guess we can, like, kind of, like, bounce around. Oh, well, for... Rest in peace, slimes, all the time blocks. But okay, so let's see what his island has. Looks like there's just a bit of um some furnaces in here. Uh, what's in here? Oh, okay, so an enchanting room and some anvils. Doesn't look like there's any like shops or anything yet. But okay, what's down here? Uh, storage shed. Okay, I guess let's just storage in there. Um, okay, so he has a little bit of a brewing station down here. I like what he did with the lava. I mean, I I don't know why, but I mean, I just think lava and it's just both nether themed, I guess, so I mean, why not, bro? And I just really like how that looks, but, okay, what else does he have? Is it Auto Brewer? Okay, it doesn't really look like it. doesn't really look like there's much um, space for redstone, but uh, what's he got down here? Okay, so he has an Iron Golem spawner, or an Iron Golem grinder right here. Doesn't look like it's a profit shop, but that that is going to make him a lot of money. I mean, that, that's more than we have, so I mean, yeah, but, okay, and what's here? Uh, oh, so he has a cactus farm, and wait. How big is this? Wait, I, I see part of it right there. It's like the chunks haven't... Wait, what? How? Okay, let me just quickly uh, uh just message him yes, I guess. But holy crap, what the heck, dude? How did you build that? I mean, I guess if you had the patience to, then sure. But yo, I, I the, the largest cactus farm I've ever built probably goes from out the ground to like here. But, uh, okay, dude, GG. Looks like he also has, um, a beacon right over here, I guess. Yeah, that gives you haste. And, um, also, uh, looks like he has, uh, a pr pretty big, um, sugarcane farm as well. Yo, I mean, normally on this server, um, farming and stuff like that doesn't really get you that much money. I mean, 90% of the people grind. But, yeah, with farms this big, uh, th this guy's probably, like, rich. And, I mean, I'm, I'm serious. These are freaking huge, but... Uh, well, bigger than I've ever built, at least, but okay, what's this? Uh, Toast Residence, off-limits to visitors. Well, okay, I guess we can look inside his, the, the delicately placed house, but okay, so, what's down here? Uh, is this anything? Okay, I think, I think this is just more storage over here, but, okay, dude, this is one heck of an island. I mean, like, well, what I mean by that is, everything is just so huge on here. I mean, like, yeah. Also, looks like he actually has, um... A, uh, what's this called? Cobblestone gen on top of this. Which, I, I mean, I, I guess that's kind of good. Be yeah, that, that's actually really smart. Because you could just be, um, like, mining right here. And, uh, the Iron Golem spawners will actually... Like, if you're close enough to... If you're too far away from them, they won't actually spawn. But you're close enough right here that they would actually spawn. So that's actually a smart placement, dude. But, holy crap, man. This is a gigantic island. I, I, I don't know, though. Did he, did he buy uh, an island upgrade? 
I mean, I'm, I'm not just gonna say, oh, he definitely bought an island upgrade just because it's hard to believe that he built all this, but yo, that what this is, this is probably, um, the largest island I have ever been to. Well, with the largest farms and all that, at least. I mean, like, Cactus Farm. I thought, when I was first coming over here, I thought it was that tall, and, uh, then I realized my chunks haven't loaded, and, I mean, yeah, this, does this go to the block limit? Hold on, let me check. Oh, it, it does go to the block limit, wait. Oh my gosh, it actually does. Holy crap, man. GG, but, um, let's just get on with the build then. But, yo, I, can, can, I, can I borrow this cactus farm at some point? Okay, nah, just kidding, but, okay. So, what I actually wanted to do today is, um, well, there were a lot of you in the comments, or well, a few of you at least, that actually told me you wanted me to set up a little area for donations. And I decided, I mean, if I just built that in one episode, that honestly wouldn't be the most exciting episode in the world. So I decided to actually make a new island spawn entirely. So basically, I decided I'm actually going to dig out right here. And as you can see, I did actually set up a little bit of an enchanting area over here. So I guess if you guys want to enchant stuff, use the anvils or anything, free to use, go ahead. But I will actually guess I'll go ahead and build that all, like, right here. And I don't know if I want to move the beacon or not, but, um... I will build something here, and I might also do stuff like, not only will that be my new island spawn, but I think I actually might set up shops so you can maybe sell gapples and vote keys and all that. I, I don't know, but let's just uh, start placing all this grass down, then. Okay, so I think this is big enough. Now, um, if I go into slash shop and um, buy some quartz, I guess, what, I, what I'm planning on doing is I actually have the same design back in, um... 4.0, but basically I'm actually gonna do, like, make this donations area, like, kind of a checker pattern of quartz and lapis. That actually looked, I mean, it honestly fits with this old island spawn over here, because, I mean, this is, like, quartz and lapis, and, well, I guess, I guess also wood, but same thing, but, okay, so let's just go ahead and start placing this down, then, so let's go do that, I guess, and, um, okay, so there, there, and there, let's go. Do I place? Okay, no, I don't need to place one right there. Wait, no, place it on the wrong spot. Okay, so let's go do that. Now, uh, I feel like I, I feel like I'm doing something wrong for some reason. I don't know, but let me try. Maybe, maybe like that. Okay, yeah, that actually that actually looks a little bit better. So I'm gonna do it like this, and um, then it's it, it's it still it still feels wrong for some reason. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna add some glowstone, because glow, glowstone solves your problems, guys. I mean, just, go, if, if you're, if you ever don't know what to build, and you're, you're just on Skyblock wondering, what the heck should I do right now? You don't want to grind, you don't want to build anything. Buy some glowstone, build something with it, guys. Glowstone is always the answer, but, but for now, I guess this is, uh, good enough. Actually, let me do, I guess I'll do that just to make it kind of like, um, uh, pillars on all sides. Okay, let's go do that. And then that right there. Okay, I think, yeah, that looks a little bit better. But let's go ahead and, uh, do I not have a hopper? Okay, may maybe I shouldn't have sold that iron I sold in the beginning. Can you buy hoppers? Maybe. I don't know where they would be. I guess, I guess I'll have to craft one then. There we go. I went ahead, grabbed a hopper. I also just went ahead and dug out a little bit of an area here. I guess I'll place this hopper. Wait, no, that's the, no, not right, guys. I need to do it like, ugh. Okay, did that, that go into the chest? Okay, good. I just need to make sure it didn't go into this block over here, but I guess I'll go ahead, place stuff back right here, and uh, let's make some signs right here. So I think I can actually use colored signs, so I can go, uh, wait, which one's blue again? Is it N, B, or N, D? I forgot. I'm just gonna go, um, donations, and then, um, in pink, or I forgot if this is blue or pink, I'm gonna do, uh, I guess just up a heart symbol, triple heart symbol, but... Okay, so, let's go and wait, did that, oh, no, wait, I can't use bold, gosh dang it, I thought I was gonna be able to use bold, but, okay, whatever, I guess I'll go ahead, and, um, I probably should actually make the colors a little bit darker then, so I'll go with dark blue, or actually, no, let's go with, like, cyan, I think that'll look nice, let's go, donations, and, uh, then heart symbol right there, okay, and then also right over here, donations, and, um, uh, heart symbol. Okay, so, there we go. And actually, I'm kind of debating whether or not I should make this the new island spawn. Because, I mean, I guess it would be nice if you could spawn over here and, like, see everything down here. But, 
I mean, I don't know. I kind of I kind of worked hard on this, but you know, I don't know. I might just actually keep this back here just as like the donation area and I guess uh you guys will have to walk over here so sorry about that, but okay. Also real quickly, um I have some chests in here, so let me grab those. I'm actually going to go ahead and make a few cell shops back here, I guess. So, let me go ahead and, um, so I believe it's like, listen, I don't need to, well, I need to type my name in here, but I think it auto-types it for me, so it's like cell one, uh, wait, no, maybe it's one cell 64 golden apple equals one, maybe. Oh, oh, that was right. Hey, okay, I got my first try, guys. Let's go. But okay, so uh, wait, no, I, I don't, I don't want to sell gap. I don't want people to sell me gapples for sixty-four. Actually, wait, hold on a second. Yes, I do. I thought that was buying gapples for a second, but okay. So sell. Um, let's go for gapples. I'll go. Uh, I'll go five k. Whatever. So let's go sell five thousand. Or no, wait, no, it's one, and then sell five thousand golden. Apple one. Okay, there we go. So let's go over here. Now, what's the idea of a vote key? Luckily, I have 29 of these in my PV. So uh, I think it's slash item right. Wait, no. Oh, no, wait. Slash item info. Okay, so 131 hashtag Y uppercase A. So let me go write that first before I forget. 131 hashtag Y. Or no, wait. Hashtag Y uppercase A. And then, um, so one sell i guess i'll go 75k for these and okay so uh let me quickly hold on was that was there a uh, colon in between there okay good there wasn't so i guess if you guys want to donate stuff if you guys want to sell me some gapples and if you guys want to sell me some vote keys i have some over here let's go ahead just i guess i'll throw all this in my second pv but okay so i don't i, I don't i tell me if you guys think i should make a new spawn here or not because i was planning on it at first but, I mean, I decided, I, I, I don't know if I should just keep this, like, the donation area, or if I should just make a entirely new spawn over there. But, anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video here. If you guys have enjoyed, be sure to slam that like button down below. Subscribe if you're new to the channel, share the video with your friends, and I will see you guys in the next one.